Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Shah. I'm a branding and web designer based in the UK. So today I'm going to be designing a skincare brand with you. I've written a bit of a list here about the brand as well as the brand values and a bit about the ideal customer. So I'm going to read them to you. So the brand is called Rituals and Radiance. It's a high-end clean beauty brand infused with quartz crystals. Um, it uses minimal but powerful ingredients and the ingredients are all natural. So the brand values are honesty, inclusivity, it's made for everyone, and it's also ethically made. Um, and in terms of the ideal client, it's made for the working woman, she's spiritual, she's someone who appreciates good design and good packaging. So I've created a mood board on Pinterest, and I've made a little bit of a mood board in Adobe Illustrator as well, so I can refer back to it. But I think for this brand, I'm gonna focus mainly on an icon logo and do really minimal text um, and a minimal typeface. So I'm gonna get started and share my screen with you, so let's jump right into it. So I wanna start with the icon logo, which I want to be an R. So I've picked out a few fonts um, that I think could work, so I'm gonna go through these now and pick which one I like the most. So originally, this one is called Katerina. I did like the design of this, but now looking at it with the others, I think it might be too thin, so I'm gonna get rid of that one. Um, I do really love this, the R here is really cool, but then I'm thinking it might be a little bit too modern for what I like, um, because I do want to make more of like a timeless classic icon, um, so I think this might go. Um, and then, so we've got these two left, I really love the curvature of this. But I also, I love the thickness of this and I love the um, tail going down here. And now looking at them both, I think I can work more with this one. It's called Kellia. Um, I also got these fonts from Invato Elements. So yeah, it's, a, it's an amazing place to find fonts. So I do love this, but I think I'm going to go with this one and manipulate it a little bit. So let's get rid of Kuraka. Okay, so now we've got the R that I like. I'm gonna manipulate this a little bit. So I'm gonna create outlines first of all. And I quite like the idea of combining a circle with this. I'm gonna take the Eclipse tool and create a circle. Maybe like that, we can adjust it later. Um, and we wanna get rid of this little bit here. So what I'm gonna do is get the path collector tool up the Pathfinder tool, sorry, click Divide, and just get rid of that little bit. Amazing. Okay. Now, I don't know if I want these little bits coming out, so I'm going to get rid of those. I really like to use the Pathfinder tool for all of this. I just find it so much easier. This and this bit. Cool. Okay, so I think I want to get rid of a little bit here. Um, so I'm going to use the Pathfinder tool again. You will notice that this is one of my favorite tools, so. <laughs> um, Click on Pathfinder, divide, and then get rid of the sections that I do not want. Okay, so I think this is looking pretty cool already. Um, I'm going to get rid of this little bit here using. Okay, I think I'll just drag it down. Perfect, I like that a lot. And I think I'm going to make this bit slightly thinner. So I'm just going to go... Okay, perfect. I'm quite happy with that. 
I think I might make the circle just a tad bit smaller. Okay, so I'm really loving how the icon logo is looking. I think I'm done with it for now. I'm just gonna merge everything together. Okay, so now I'm going to get the actual typeface up. I think I'm gonna go with something simple, which I think Railway might work for this one. So I'm just gonna type out Rituals and Radiance. Font. I think railway my word. Let's try that. Okay, I think already that looks pretty cool. I like that it's spaced out. Okay, maybe let's try 350. Cool. Um, let's make that a bit smaller. There we go, I like that, it's very simple, which is what I was going for. Um, and we could even incorporate both of these things, so if I wanted to. Pretty cool. Okay, so we've got the logos and submarks ready. Now I'm gonna go into the color palette, which I'm thinking I'm gonna go quite neutral with this. So keep it like black and white and nude. So I'm gonna have a play around with some colors now. dark brown, uh, a bit of a pale nude, a pale pink, and a black, and I've taken some of these from my mood board over here, incorporated some of the colors from the Quartz Crystal, some of the packaging that I like. So I'm going to play around with these colors. They are tentative for now, I might change them up, but for now I'm going to play around with these ones and see how I like them. I'm done playing around with the colors. I changed the pink to more of a gray just because I thought it matched with the theme a little bit better. I thought the pink made it look a bit too young and fun, which is not what we were going for. Um, so I'm happy with how it looks now. Now I'm gonna create some mock-ups and I'm going to introduce you to the brand Rituals and Radiance. <laughs> So 
we've come to the end of the video. I hoped you liked designing a skincare brand with me and I hope you liked how it turned out. If you like videos like these, please don't forget to subscribe and give it a thumbs up. I really, really appreciate it. For now, I am going to end the video here, but thank you so much for watching.